So you've installed Blender and Blender BIM and luckily you have the latest version of Blender BIM and if not, then please do update to the latest version. And depending on when you've last used Blender BIM, then you may notice some UI changes. The point is to make you less confused and unify the user interface by making it more intuitive and separating Blender from Blender BIM functionality. Some panels haven't been moved yet, but there will be at some point, so please just have some patience. Before going any further, we'll tweak the BIM workspace that has been now created by default upon installation of Blender BIM. I'd like to change the viewport color to make it a little bit more white. And I also want to change the color of my selected objects to something more visible. Edit, Preferences, Themes, 3D Viewport. And for my active object, I'd like it to be blue. And the object selection will be red. I also want to change the decorations colors in Blender BIM. So under Add-on and Blender BIM, you can go down here and find decorations color and make it black. Then we need to also set our snaps. So press on the magnet and then select a few of these. I like the vertex edge and also face edge and edge perpendicular, that's fine. Let's delete all of this. And instead we're gonna create a plane and we'll toggle this little menu write one meter here for the size then let's go to a top view and we'll press g to move this plane x to constrain it on the x-axis and we'll type in 0 0.5 then gy 0 0.5 then we'll also press shift shift a and we'll add an empty object which is these arrows here and this shows us the z y and x axes sometimes helpful to have this false origin here and we'll rename it to false origin and maybe this plane to one by one okay let's now go to file defaults save startup file and click on save startup file again 